Hello, Armando Perez Carreno here, and in this video I want to show you how to fix the missing Edit with Elementor button from Elementor 3.0 and upwards and auto-optimize. If you are used to working with Elementor and you're used to seeing this top button that says Edit with Elementor on any page that you have edited with Elementor before, and now you update it to a more recent version and suddenly it's gone, and you're using Auto Optimize, then I'm gonna show you how to fix that very easily. So let's imagine that you're on your site and you're seeing it and it looks like this. You don't have the Edit with Elementor button, but you do have Auto Optimize. Let's go in the back end and fix it right now. So we're, when we're in the backend, we're just gonna jump back into settings and select Auto Optimize, and that will take us to the Auto Optimize options. The only thing you have to do here is to deselect where it says aggregate JS files. If you do that and go down here and select save changes and empty cache, that will allow you to have the Edit with Elementor button back again. Let's try it here. I'm gonna refresh the page, same page we were looking at earlier, and there it is, Edit with Elementor. It's now available, we can use it now. And we still have Auto Optimize and we're still minifying files, etc. The only thing we're not doing is aggregating the files, which is another process, which I won't get into right now from Auto Optimize. So that's the way you can fix it. Very straightforward, very easy. And if you like this video, please make sure to subscribe to look at other videos down the road.